Hello and welcome to Pokemon Alert. Today I'll be unboxing a box of 10 cards I sent to PSA or Professional Sports Authority over a year ago and I got back. They come box in a big box of packaging but they come really in this little box inside of that and you just pull them out and get them out. So I'm going to go get them out and we'll get started. The next card is a 2000 Pokemon Gym Challenge Blaine's Arcanine, the Hall of First Edition, the number one card. Um, I'm looking at this one to see what grading we have. Um, on the front, you look for any scratches or blemishes. I know this one has a couple minor scratches just to the left of the nose of the Arcanine. Um, but the edges look clean and crisp, no whiteness or fraying. The centering looks really, really good. On the back, we're going to look for any blemishes or scratches, and I don't see any. The edges look really crisp and clean, no fraying or whiteness. And our centering is not too bad, a little off on the lower left compared to the lower right. And because of the scratches on the front, I bet you that'll lower our grade a little bit. And let's see what we get. Oh, I meant six. I expected that with the scratches on the front. Our next card is the 2000 Pokemon Gym Challenge Brock's Nine Tails, the Hollow First Edition, the number three card. And look at the front of this card for any blemishes or scratches. I don't see any. Then I'm looking at the edges for any fraying or whiteness, and they look really clean. And now to our centering, and our centering looks not too bad. Maybe a little off from the right to the left, and we'll go to the the back looks really clean, no blemishes or scratches. The edges look really clean and crisp, no fraying or whiteness. And then we look at our centering, and our centering is off on the lower left compared to the lower right. And that will get us a grade of a mint nine. That is pretty awesome. Nice job. Our next card is the 2000 Pokemon Gym Challenge Giovanni's Gyarados, a hollow first edition, the number five card. Looking at this card, the front looks really crisp and clean, no blemishes or scratches. The edges look really clean, no fraying and, or whiteness. And then we're looking at the centering. The centering looks really good from, from top to bottom and side to side. Jumping to the back, we're looking for any scratches or blemishes on the back. I don't see any. We're looking for at our edges. Our edges look really crisp and clean, including the corners, no fraying or whiteness. And then we're looking at the centering, and the centering looks pretty darn good on the back. So our grade will be a grade nine. Awesome, awesome, nice Gyarados. The next card is the 2000 Pokemon Gym Challenge Giovanni's Nido King, the Hall of First Edition, the number seven card. Looking at this one, the front is really clean, no blemishes or scratches. The edges look really crisp and clean, no fraying or white areas. Um, the centering on this one from top to bottom looks pretty good from left to right. The right looks a little shallower than the left. Looking at the back, the back uh, looks pretty good, no blemishes or scratches. The edges look really crisp and clean, um, but we do have a centering problem on the lower left compared to the lower right. So with the grade, um, the centering on the back, our grade will be A mint 9. Awesome. That's pretty good for that card. The card is a 2000 Pokemon Gym Challenge Koga's B Drill, the Hollow First Edition, the number 9 card. Looking at the front of this card, I don't see any blemishes or scratches. Um, the edges look crisp and clean, no fraying with whiteness. And the centering on the front doesn't look too bad. On the back, I don't see any damage or blemishes. Uh, the edges look really crisp and clean, no damage to them, no fraying. And from the centering on the back, doesn't look too bad, except there is a little slight, I think, um, off centering from the lower left compared to the lower right and that should give us a grade of a mint nine I like that good job for a beedrill the card is a 2000 Pokemon Gym Challenge Plains Nine Tails, the first edition uh, number 21 card look in the front of it you don't want any scratches or blemishes 
looking at the centering of the front from top to bottom and side to side on this one I think there's a little less on the right than the left and looking at the edges you want to make sure they're crisp and clean no white showing through and um, no fraying on the back you want to make sure there it looks really good no damage to the back you want to look at your centering and make sure it looks really good on this one it looks not too shabby um, and you want to look at the edges for any fraying or white showing and our grade is going to be a mint nine for a blank nine tails awesome gotta love dines the card is a 2000 pokemon gym challenge giovanni's nitto queen the first edition number 23 card looking at the surface of this card it looks really clean no scratches or damage the centering looks really good from side to side and top to bottom and i don't see any damage or fraying on the edges looking at the back i don't see any damage that i can tell from on the back uh, the centering looks a little off maybe on the lower left compared to the lower right and the edges look really clean i don't see any white showing through and that's going to give us a grade of a mint nine that's pretty good like it the card is a 2000 pokemon gym challenge koga's arbok the first edition number 25 card looking at the surface of this card i don't see any damage scratches or blemishes looking at the front centering from side to side doesn't look real bad from top to bottom looks like it might be okay and our edge looks pretty crisp around the edges and I don't see any whiteness. Looking at the back, I um, it looks pretty good. The centering isn't too bad. The surface isn't too bad. I do see a little edge damage on the upper right corner. And um, besides that, it looks pretty good. And with that, our final grade is going to be a mint nine. Nice, I like dines. The card is a 2000 Pokemon Gem Challenge Koga's Pidgeotto, the first edition, number 27 card. The front surface of this card looks really clean. There's no scratches or damage. Uh, the centering on the front of the card looks really good from top to bottom and side to side. The edges on this front of the card looks crisp and clean. There's no damage or fraying. The back side of the card looks really good the centering looks really good the overall image looks non-damaged um, our edges look pretty good there might be a little up on the upper right corner some a uh, little bit of white showing or some fraying and that's going to give us a grade of mint nine nice i like it the card is a 2000 pokemon gym challenge to bring us gengar the first edition uh, number 29 card looking at the front surface of this card there is no damage or scratches the s centering on the front of the card looks really good from side to side and top to bottom the edges on the front of the card are crisp and clean with no white showing through the back side of the card looks really good the centering is really good from side to side and top to bottom the uh, surface doesn't show any damage um, looking at the edges, I do have a little edge damage, a little white showing through and fraying on the upper right corner and the lower left corner. And this will give us a grade of mint nine. Awesome. Not too bad.